We can't go anywhere else. It's all all closed off to us. Good. Let's go, Box! Get that spirit directly back to the Krizoa Palace. I am adjusting your flight path so that you will land at the top of the palace. As soon as you get there, head down inside to release the spirit. Pepper out! And they still, still make you fly through one gold ring. Well. You better make that gold ring super easy. There it is. One, 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 one. Get it. Yeah. Woo. I was very tempted to miss it. You fucker. On purpose. <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> you know what? I would have respected the play. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I would have been upset in the moment, but I would have thought it was very funny later. Yeah. <laughs> ah, the last, the last one. The last one of these. Oh. <laughs> um. All right. Hey now. I'm sorry. I thought I thought Fox would bounce off like he bounce off of everything else. <laughs> How did you manage to find the one wall that you don't just fly through? I, I mm. Why is that a thing? Why is that there? <laughs> well, okay, Star Fox. I guess you know Star Fox has to remind me what I'm playing sometimes. Why? It's one last fuck you for the road. Exactly. Now, okay, I haven't played every Star Fox game. Most of what I've played is, like, the first one and 64, and a little bit of, like, the prototype of two. I don't yeah. remember a single instant kill in any of those. No, I I still have my Super Nintendo copy of Star Fox 64. Or... The Star Fox yeah. <laughs> 1, and then I also have my N64 copy. And no, I don't think there's anything that just straight up one hit kills you. That's that's a rare special. That's the rare touch. Exactly. The high flying space action Star Fox is known for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let's go say hello to our friend. What's her face? <laughs> She's been in this game for so long. Hello. There she is. Guess we'll have to go down and let her out. Oh. Now that I know how little of Crystal is actually in this video game, the fact that she's like a furry icon is actually kind of funny now. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? She's in here for like 30 minutes. Yeah, she's in like the opening cutscene, and then like you really don't hear from her until now. Right. Yeah. If if Dinosaur Planet had actually come out the way it was supposed to, she had a much bigger role. Yeah. And I think you could like switch between the two main characters. Okay. That would have made this game a lot more interesting, I think, if you had kept that and just, like, switched between Fox and Crystal. Yeah. To and, do like, what? And, like, Rare made Donkey Kong 64. <laughs> I know they know how to make a video game like that. <laughs> Where you switch between characters and some of the characters can go here and some can go there. They yeah, already you know, I was, I was just thinking I needed a... a a lot of different collectibles that I could only collect with one character at a time. Oh god, no, never mind, I yeah, take it back. No, I, I take it that. back. Bad idea. And, oh! This is the last one. The last Sharp Claw. Wow. Should let's, I Let's hurt give him? him a proper send-off. <laughs> Ow. Because well, I think this is the first you time you've fought let's go. one in the past three videos. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna make him whiff. I'm gonna whiff punish him. Check this shit out. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> My spacing's so bad. What? You can't block out a dash. That's cheating. 
game is busted. This is an SNK boss. <laughs> That's it, everybody. The final sharp claw. What a fierce combatant. <laughs> Why did we need six cuts of Star Fox doing a Scott Stapp? So I was just <laughs> thinking that the, the six cuts from different angles thing was a very early 2000s thing of them to do in this video game. Yeah. <laughs> It's like it's like a super appropriate for the era this came out in. Yeah, that's true. And wouldn't you know it, we have to walk all the way back. <laughs> of course we do. Nothing's gonna happen during that walk. They no. could have just put us there, but no, 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 no. I have optional fights I could do. Optional sharp claw super bosses like this guy. We're not going to. Mm -mm, no, he's not the last one. We already killed the last one. Please don't. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's only half a heart. Right. <laughs> well. Ow, my bones. Oh well. <laughs> Walk it off. God damn it. This this temple could use some up and down arrows. Yeah, yeah. To let me know which one of these fucking wind turbines that looks all the fucking same. Which one goes up and which one goes down? So what I kind of wonder is if the maps for Dinosaur Planet were originally supposed to be this big. And that's why there's nothing in them. They blew their entire polygon budget on the architecture. <laughs> uh, maybe. Just gotta go check out that beta, see see uh, how populated their other maps are. I won't be doing that. But if anybody yeah, knows, if anybody either. has actually <laughs> done that already, I would be interested in the answer. Just not yeah. interested enough to go do it myself. I hope you understand. Hmm. Uh-oh. This is usually a fight door. We're locked in by uh, cowboy pirates. And there's there's one soul floating around. I think that, that that's what that's supposed to be. Oh. Indicating we need to kill one more person. <laughs> so what you're telling me is this is the Dark Souls of boss fights. Sure. Yeah, this is the hardest. There's a fog door, and you fight. need to get a soul. Like, <laughs> come on. I've been waiting for you, Fox McCloud. Who are you? you may oh yeah, it's finally time for the boss fight with General Scales. Now you must face me. Here we go. Scales. You are no longer any use to me. Who are you? I demand you show yourself. I am the one you brought to Krozoa Palace. The Earthwalkers could see me, but you could not. I don't understand. Yes, yeah, same. No, I didn't think you would. Your desire for power overwhelmed you and blinded you to the truth inside. Now give Fox what he's looking for. Give him the final Krizoa spirit. You will regret this. And then Scales just keels over uh -oh. and dies. It was in him all this time. What happened to the video quality? It's so bad. Recognize it from somewhere. Oh, we're in weird weirdo vision. We've yeah, the been weirdo... in that once before at the start of the game. Yeah. And that weirdo vision pushed Crystal into the crystal. Yeah. Alright, good boss fight. Yeah. So so cool. So cool how they do that. I'm 
amazed at the ways this game has disappointed me. Like, it's gone up. Don't even get to fight general scales. It's gone right? up. You don't even get to fight the big bad. Just above and beyond in doing absolutely nothing. Well, are you ready for the end? The final cutscene? The final boss? You know the answer. Press push, the button. Push the button. I'm gonna push, push the, the button. button. Fens, I need you to push the button. Thank you. With okay. arms wide open. There we go. <laughs> Fox, you've been nominated for a video music award? <laughs> Oh, the radio's back. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, it shouldn't show up for the actual capture. <laughs> no! There's something about the Canadian women's national team. I don't know what sport... But that's what I heard before it cut out. I'm just glad it's picking up like a sport radio and not something fucking weird. Well, it is Super Bowl Sunday, so I think all radio that is not music <laughs> is probably sports radio today. True. That's true. That's right. We're super cool. And instead of football, we're watching Star Fox Adventures. I'm, I live in Philadelphia and I'm afraid to go outside later. I'm going to be real with you. Game's not for a few hours anyway. That's the first time they have ever actually seen each other. Right. I am reborn, the mighty Crossword God. <laughs> that stand before me. So now we gotta kill Zardoz? We will never kneel to you. We don't even know who you are. Hey, wait. Well, thanks for nothing. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't be standing here at all. It's her My staff, dog. Fox. You're back. The one cutscene she gets with her staff, and she's fucking, like, clipping her hand all through it. Uh, the disappointment of a video game. Alright, bye! Are, are you ready to be more disappointed? Oh my god, it's a giant floating head. We're doing the Andros fight. Yeah. Oh my god. Are we actually doing the fight, or is it just going to be a cutscene? Uh, uh, could go either way. I'd be looking forward to this fuck you. Oh, it's literally Andros. Okay. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> fuck Some you. Somehow, Andros has returned. Just, it doesn't make any fucking sense. Why? Oh, are you ready for the worst Andross fight I've ever had to do? Hopefully this will go nice and smoothly. Oh, oh you got hit by the Ure. Okay, so this is sort of relevant because last night, um, Wayne Radio TV did like a behind the scenes on the Nova screen, which just wrapped up last week. And part of that was like, Everybody wanted Benry to appear at the end, and he was like, that would have been such a cop-out and would not have made sense with the story, and I'm really feeling that right now watching this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is the Saturday morning cartoon ends. And just the villain comes back again. I don't know. Jesus. Oh, if you get sucked into his mouth, you get pushed all the way back through his head and you have to do the first phase over again of course oh, and his God. hands regenerate i'm just i'm and imagining... i'm going to do my best to not show that off i'm trying to imagine somebody playing through this game never having played another star fox and and thinking that you know the the little travel sections between areas really prepared them for this yeah. Like, this is very... This is actually, like, hard. It's so hard to tell, like, where this stupid projectile is going on camera. Mm -hmm. And then he's shooting stuff out of his head that's, like, clipping out from his head. 
It's super hard to avoid while getting shots off. And there's a very real chance that I die and have to start over, though restarting is quick. I would kindly request that you don't. <laughs> yeah. Does this do the thing it. where if you shoot him in the eye enough, he like stops and rubs his eye and leaves his other hand no. open? No, no, you don't get to do that. You don't so have they any way. They didn't even give you that. Great. No. You just have to like hope you get enough rings to live and don't get sucked into this. Uh, okay, that was close. Oh, and this is great. Now his hands do this, and you have to shoot the target that is also firing things at you, which is not a pain in the ass at all. No. no. Especially when you can't tell where the fucking thing is aiming. Oh my god, I almost got hit there. Okay, please just give me a bunch of rings so that I can finish the next phase. Your stupid handout so I can delete it. So this is the most tension I felt watching this up until that's this point. That's true. So that's good. This is the one that's felt the most like a boss fight. Yeah. Hey McCloud, different time, different planet, and you still need Falco's help. It's good to see you, buddy. All right. So now the goal is to not get hit by rocks, which is RNG. Uh-huh. And I have to sh not get hit by these, which can be hard, because this is the worst controlling Star Fox game I've ever played. Oh, I bet. Yeah, I remember the flight not being particularly good in this mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. And then he does that, and then you... Okay. I guess. Okay. I did a lot of damage, so we, we should be okay. Cool. I love getting hit by rocks because I cannot tell where anything is because the perspective <laughs> keeps shifting. This rare doesn't know what the fuck they're doing. Oh, I'm no. begging you. I'm begging you. Open the mouth. Come on, come on, come on, come on, yes! There we go. <sighs> I'm putting my controller down. So Falco showed up. They made like a big deal about him coming to help you. Did he do anything? He, he was the one who was dropping the bombs for me so I could shoot oh, them into yeah, okay. Andross's All face. Right. Yeah. All right. Anyway, I that boss fight is a very sudden spike in difficulty. Yeah, the, the, with the chaos of the asteroids, I, like, assumed the bombs were, like, coming out of some of the asteroids you shot. No. No, the only thing that the asteroids give you is rings, and you usually only get, like, one, maybe two. Oh, there goes the planet. Okay, yeah, I was about to ask, so are the chunks of the planet just gonna go back on their own, or what? Yeah. I guess. They'll just slot right back in. Wow. Great. Beautiful. Great. We saved that orb.
That is every single sharp claw that is in this game. <laughs> Why does that one have the championship belt? <laughs> this is all the sharp claws I ran past and didn't kill. Yeah. That's that's why they're they're cheering. They're like, thank you for sparing me. Oh, it's the opposite of uh, of that Metal Gear Solid Three thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we did it, Fox. Who's we? So what do you mean we? <laughs> you did it, Fox. Me, I did it. Did a great job. Didn't do anything. Good work, Star Fox team. I received a message from the king and queen Earthwalker. How? Where's Falco? He actually helped. <laughs> they he sent you the an email. I was, however, very surprised to hear that Andros was still alive. Yeah, me too. Me too, know. General Pepper. It seems that Andros discovered the ancient power of the Krizoa, and by trapping Crystal, who had the ability to channel this power, which he, he knew somehow, to this energy to revive himself. Well, he is a great genius. Of course. He is the only one with the brains to rule Lilac. We could finally repair the ship! And I really need some oil. These joints are not what they used to be. And I can't wait to get back with the Star Fox team. Hey guys, you don't mind if I hang with you again, do ya? That is not the Falco voice I remember. That's <laughs> fucking me up so bad. <laughs> team is back together again oh fox i almost forgot i received this message from crystal she also has your email fox, i really appreciate what you did for me i'm just so sorry we didn't get much of a chance to talk i'm left with just one more thing to do and that's to say thank you she has impeccable timing <laughs> the fuck <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> You're not shy, are you, Fox? My sensors indicate Fox's temperature is rising. Are you okay, Fox? If you want to see more, check out <laughs> e621.net. <laughs> <laughs> just fine. I'm sure you could also find some things on furaffinity.net if you really know the right search terms. <laughs> if, if you're scared and you don't know what you're doing, try just going to Google first and turning off safe search. Let your heart guide you from there. <laughs> oh boy, we're done! Christ alive, what a game! Oh! Oh boy, what did what did everyone think? Um, well, I'm glad I never finished this video game as a teenager <laughs> because I ooh, <laughs> ooh, I would not have been happy about it. 2013! <laughs> Since 2013, <laughs> you've been trying to get me to LP this game with you. <laughs> and now, and now you, you, we've done it. And now you never I have even, to ask me again. I didn't even know either one of you in 2013. <laughs> right. <laughs> Standing outside a bar after playing fighting games, Fens comes up to me and is like, "Hey, do you know about Let's Plays?" <laughs> and here we are. <laughs> Yep, and as a direct result, that's how I met Link's winners. And, um, oh my Benz, God. I don't think we started talking until uh, the Snouts Dot Online era. Something like that, yeah. Yeah, but like I, I was like, oh, Benz is here. Benz hangs out with Link's winners. That's cool. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's it's a, a big yet small world. It is. Yep. Well, like so, I mean, every. Everyone from, like, the early 2010s that was doing Let's Plays is now, like, queer to some degree, so, or a furry, or both, <laughs> which at the time was, like, my funny haha -ha theory, and then it, like, kept turning out to be real as the years went on, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, th we're in the voice acting section, so now I you get to see how many people pulled, uh, multiple voices. Oh, good. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jay Silk was busy. Creature in Well. S Brand. It's Russell Bear Brand. Yes, yeah, Russell Brand. <laughs> One Sharp Claw. Notice, notice a big old lack of first names. <laughs> 
wonder if that was by choice. Uh, Miyamoto is in these credits too at the very beginning, and it's yeah. just S Miyamoto. Okay. <laughs> This is some extremely unearned shredding. Oh, wait till you hear what the song after this one is, once this single loop ends. Oh no! Oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Shout out to the Super Mario Club. <laughs> I don't know who you are, but you're in the credits of every Nintendo game. <laughs> The voice actress for Crystal did the entire French localization for this game. Wow. That's pretty cool. Whoa. <laughs> or at least she's the only one credited. Right. 2002. God, what a game. <sighs> And now, then it just play, boots uh, you right back to the main menu. Well, yeah, everybody, well, thank you so much for watching our 10 hours of Star Fox. <laughs> I mean, I had a lot of fun, even if the game wasn't good. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm glad everyone had a good time. Like, it won't even tell me my completion rate, because you just don't have a chance to save. You can never have a file that just says 100%. True. And, uh, you can have like a file that says 99%. Oh, because it doesn't save after you win. Oh, yeah. no. Well, that was Star Fox. That was all of Star Fox. We do have one more video that we have to do because all of the cheat tokens do in fact unlock things. True. So we yeah. will have one more short video after that looking at all of that stuff. But now that the, now that the lettuce play is done... You can you can tell people the only other let's play on the LP archive of this game was some screenshot LP from like 2009. Oh, I feel like you're missing out on a lot with a screenshot LP. I remember I remember you're missing a lot out of people on so attempting much. this game uh, on SA at the time, like in the early 2010s, and like none of them finished. No, none of them would finish because have you seen you've seen 10 hours well, of this yeah. game? It's 10 hours of that. So like I'm. Like in the middle of a 100 video Yakuza Zero let's play, <laughs> so, so like 10 hours is like nothing to me now. But I've also been doing this for over a decade, right? Like Cooking Mama was 10 years ago. True. But also Yakuza yeah, Zero and Yakuza is a good has, game. It all it has things to do in it. There's you things. don't complete your task and then you do your daily commute back to Thorntail Hollow before you do you drive off to do the next task in the morning. Yeah, but I did make uh, the squad sit through all of Cabaret Club Czar, so... <laughs> you know what? That's fine. <laughs> I sped it up. But there were, a lot, there were a lot of videos that were just that. Yeah, true. So... Alright, well, I'm going to hit stop recording on the video game. Okay, thank you everyone. <laughs>